Happy St. Patty's Day, everybody. Um, it's snowing right now, you know, March 17th. Um, but what a time to be alive, right? I mean, if you think about it, what a time to be alive. I went to the supermarket today uh, just to get some things that we need and by 8 a.m. it was already picked over. So um, just what a time, you know, what a time to be alive, you know? Um, but if you put it in perspective, put it in this perspective that each one of us are here right now. We are alive right now because somebody in our lines of ancestry was strong enough to hold it together, was strong enough to survive whatever that they were going through, the Civil War, World War I, World War II, uh, whatever you know, epidemic was going on uh, during their lifetime. They were strong enough, they were resilient enough to survive. And you are here now because of that resilience. And so I want to encourage you to not be completely overwhelmed with you know, what's going to happen next week or what's going to happen in two weeks or you know what's going to is the nba season going to resume um you know and we can lose our minds we can lose sleep over trying to think about the future and i want to hopefully challenge you to to not lose sight of the now you know a lot of us have been given this precious opportunity to be home with our family and honestly i wouldn't want to be in quarantine with anybody else um, so take advantage of this time to breathe, you know, be with your family, um, shut the news off, uh, you know, social media, Facebook is, it's crazy, but remember that you are part of an ancestry that through the years you've made it and you're here now and a hundred years from now, somebody will say that they're here because of you, because you were strong enough because you were resilient enough to survive this. So, we've got this, we're all in together. We are one people. Stop discriminating, you know, race, age. We're here together, we're one people. So, let's heal together, all right? This is day eight, this is my memento.